How's it going, everyone? Um, so in this video, I am going to talk about how to get rid of chest acne and back acne. So before I get started, please subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. I do appreciate the support. It helps my channel grow. Please follow me on Instagram, DylanBerg999. So chest acne and back acne, um, I've had both before. I've had facial acne as well. I've had basically acne basically throughout my whole body. So I know how to get rid of it. It can be very, very annoying. A couple of reasons why you're getting acne. Usually acne is associated with high sugar intake. So obviously there's the obvious one, like you're growing up, right? Hormones, stuff like that. You're going to get, um, you're going to get some acne, but uh, there are other reasons why you're getting more acne than maybe the average person. Maybe the average person has a little bit of acne and you have a ton of acne. So like I said, sugar intake is very, very, um, correspond, it, it corresponds well with the amount of acne that you're getting. So more sugar you're consuming, the more acne you're going to be getting. It's literally directly related, indirectly related. Or how, I don't know. Um, they're both related, you guys. The more sugar you have, the more acne you're going to have. And I noticed this myself. I noticed I was getting acne really on my face. This was this was the main one on my face. And um, I just, I, I could not figure it out. And then I'm like, okay, I've been drinking a couple of pops some chocolate, stuff like that. And I was doing that like daily. I'm like, I'm having a lot of sugar. And yeah, my my acne was terrible. Once I lowered that, just started drinking water, nothing but water. And um, the acne completely cleared up. Might've had a little bit, but com com mainly gone. Oxy pads work really, really well too. I've used those um, for like two years and they completely, completely keep the acne at bay. You will not get it as long as you use like one pad a day right before, again, there's just, there's little pads and you just wipe them on your face. You use one before going to bed, you will never have acne. So it's amazing. I really, really like those. They help me a lot. Um, next one is um, sweating. Sweating can cause acne if you leave it on your skin. Usually what you should do is after you're done sweating, after you've done a workout, it's best to shower as soon as possible to remove the sweat. So if you're someone that goes to the gym, then you wait a couple hours after before showering, this could be a big, big reason why you're getting the chest and the back acne. And that actually happened to me with my back acne. I was starting to get it. I'm like, why am I getting back acne? And it's because after I was done working out, I would just put deodorant on and um, I would just put like a shirt on and the sweat was still there. A little bit of sweat, obviously. And um, yeah, I was getting back acne. So the minute I was done working out, I started showering immediately and the acne went away. So I really recommend that. End of video. Thank you so much for watching.